What's up, kids? Who's technical? I'm back again with another video today. As you can see, I went ahead and picked me up a Nest a Google Nest Hub. This is the seven-inch display, the second generation. So it has the Hey Google. I am. I was over using my phone as an alarm clock, and I know I can get that set up with this product here. Not only that, I can have access to the weather and so on and so on so i thought i'd pick one up i picked this up off of best buy so here are some of the apps you can have quick access some of the things you can have quick access to but uh we're gonna just unbox this and try to get this sucker set up but this is what it looks like as you can see this is what it looks like i got the one with the black on the back the chunk the black i thought that would look good so pretty much we're just gonna unbox it you all know they have the seven inch and then they have a Nest Hub. They have a Nest Hub Max. Wasn't I didn't want the Nest Hub Max. I didn't need anything anything that big. So I went this route. You know, I thought it was cool. This is a cool little device to have in your room or your kitchen, wherever, so on and so on. So like I said, it's something that I've been needing, just hadn't had a chance to pick one up. But now I have one in front of me, and we're going to see what it's all about, which I pretty much know what it's all about, but still, I'm going to check it out together with you. So pretty much, this is what the front looks like, shows you what you can do and everything on there. So, set this here for now. And when you open it up, you are greeted with your product. This looks nice, you know, it's just like a looks like a little tablet that is just connected to a little dock on the back. As you can see, like I said, I did that black colorway. I thought that looks nice. Doesn't feel too uh doesn't feel too heavy, but it doesn't feel too light. Let's see what else you get in the box. You do get your information that you might need if you want to read that. I don't need that. And you also get your cable to plug up your device. You get your cable right here to plug up your the device. You know, you get your Google logo on there because this is a Google product. You get your cable. So now, I'm going to put everything back in the box. I'm going to get the box out of the way. I'm going to put the box here for now. And we're just going to unwrap the product just like that. It's simple. Nothing too crazy. But like I said, it's just something that I know I've been wanting to, you know, add to my room collection i just hadn't had a chance to go pick one up but this is what it looks like that would be tight if they made it to where you could have since you buy a black one that would be nice if the tablet could be black instead of them all being white that would be nice so now i'm going to attempt to plug this in so we can get it set up and what better way to set it up with a Google device so I have my uh, Google for the video so once you plug it in to the wall it does currently cut on as you can see this is what it looks like when it cuts on nothing too crazy and yes this is touch screen so now I know I'm going to need to go download the Google Home app. Hi. To get started, download the Google Home app like on I phone said, or tablet. The mic's off. Okay, my mic's off. That's good because I don't want it saying anything right now. But this is your button right here to where you cut the mic on and off when it's red, it's off. And when you push it this way, the mic's back on. it's back on. But the I'm going to cut on. it off right now.
this up closer to my bed, like I said, because this is pretty much for me for to be used like an alarm clock, basically. Try so up from the bottom of the screen. I don't want to set that up just yet. So it says swipe up from the bottom of the screen. So we're just gonna swipe up. See your most recent and commonly used apps. So here's you my. See all of your apps. You tap here on see all. Okay. This is where you can control some settings. Okay. Like screen brightness, alarms, and a few other things. Okay. So she's talking. I'm gonna have to cut her off. But anyways, like she said, these are some of my recent apps. So I have my YouTube. I can have Spotify. Uh, let's see if we go into YouTube. Let's see what this actually does. And what it actually looks like you know I'm not like I said this is not for me to this is not for me to watch any video content or anything on here even though you can do that maybe if you had little kids or something this is not for that I mainly bought this so this sole purpose is for me to have a uh, and a little smart alarm clock for myself with the alarm so I can set reminders and so on and so on. But here's your brightness. You can set your brightness level if you want to. Uh, it has your controls. It has your media. It has media. Communicate. So you can have make video calls with it. You can make a phone call through your phone with it. Uh, it says games, but I will not be playing any games on this. Like I said, this is not why I picked up the device. And then it has discover, discover new things. Then if you click here, you can see all your little apps, which is crazy because I didn't think this had little apps, but this is what you get. This is it. This is what you get. Can't download more. But that's okay. Like I said, I'll be using Pandora with this. So if I wanted to play my music out loud. So let's see if I can change. Set up a photo frame. That's what we were just doing. It says, say, hey, Google, to set up photo frame. Hey, Google. So pretty much this is what you would get if you, you know, just set it on your desktop. This is what it'll look like, which is nice. You get the big clock and that's what I need. If you slight, swipe to the left, you get that. Then swipe up. Then here you go, alarms. This is what I need. You have no alarm set. So pretty much when I want to set an alarm for work, I would just need to go in here and just hit set an alarm and then I'll be able to set my alarm. Cause like I said, this is what I mainly pick this device up for, to set alarms, to check the weather, set things for schedules and so on and so on. But nothing, it's not for my, you know, it's, you know, nothing for me to just be playing around with. I just wanted something to where I did not have to use my phone always to wake me up every morning, you know, to get up and start my day. I'd rather have something like this to where I'm able to just use it and interact with it or say, hey, stop and be done. But overall, this is nice. This is nice. Now, if you get the bigger one, I'm sure you'll be even more happier with the bigger one because it's an eight point, it's an eight inch display. But like I said, I didn't need anything that big so you have a dark theme and you have a light theme I didn't need anything that big this seven inches was uh, this is perfect you know they had it to where you can buy one of them you can buy it and then you can buy they had it to where they come with two device two uh, nest hubs I didn't nest hubs I didn't need two, you know but eventually if I want to add another nest hub I can always go back and pick it up because I believe this was just forty nine dollars and ninety nine cents so that wasn't too bad and this is just some of the little information it has in your settings There's your my Google, like that. Hey Google, I mean, you can look at your afternoon, your wellness, your home controls. I can cut my mic back on. 
the mic's back on. Okay, so now when the mic's on, I can actually say, hey, Google. And it will do what I need it to do. Hey, Google, check the okay. weather. Hey, Google, check the weather. Right now in Tulsa, it's 63 degrees and partly cloudy. Today, it'll be cloudy with a forecasted high of 71 and a low of 37. This is how you turn up your volume. It's a little button on the side here. Turn the volume up and down, which is very nice. Very nice, very slim, very sleek. So you have little routines. You can do bedtime, good morning, I'm home. You have speakers and TVs. Then you have your different rooms. And like I said, it has my room right here and it says it's off, but we can cut it on like that. Sorry something went wrong for Kia's room TV because I don't have the room TV. Connect it. But overall, this will be, this is just a nice little touch, like I said, to have. If you're somebody out there that just wanted a smart little alarm clock like me, I was really in the need for a smart alarm clock for a while, you know, but I finally picked me up one, and now I am uh, good to go. I can link my Netflix. I can set up du uh, duo calls, uh, set up no location. So if I wanted to uh, go to my phone settings, I could do that and I could set that up. But I may do some of that a little later. I just wanted to get on here and get this uh, unboxed and show you that I do currently have a Google Next Hub paired with my Google Pixel 6 Pro because like I said, what better way to have a Google device connect it to the mic's off. a Google smartphone and this is your Google Home app like I said you have to have your Google Home app and once you download your Google Home app you are able to do things within the Google Home app to access your Google Home so just rate comment and subscribe to this YouTube tech channel and I'll catch you in the next video I'm out